Hi everyone, it's Crafty Mom with Three Sets of Twins. I hope you're going to enjoy our channel today and if you would subscribe, that would be wonderful. And hit the like button and the notification bell. And always remember to be kind to each other. And have a great day. Hey everyone, I got this frame from Dollar Tree of course and of course the bag. I'm just going to cut it. I'm using a pencil just to square it off and I'm just going to put it in this frame. I love the little sparkles because I am a sparkle girl and it just sort of puts some pizzazz into our lives. I just cleaned off the glass. I'm going to put the little paper back into the frame. This is just a quick five minute craft that you can use. And I'm just going to add some little flowers that I got from Dollar Tree. They're like, they're almost like a felt, but they're not. They're like a, a plastic felt. It's very strange, but they're very pretty. And there you have it. <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day frame. This one is that cute little wooden truck that you see at Dollar Tree. And I went ahead and spray painted it with just some Rust-Oleum white spray paint. I prefer spray painting rather than painting. And now I'm just going through with my marker pen just to outline some of the different like doors and windows on this cute little wooden truck. And then they have these cute little wooden hearts that come in a little plastic bag at Dollar Tree. And I'm just going to glue them over top of the little hearts that are already on the truck. I have this cute bow that I've had for a while. I think I got it years ago, probably in Michael's. And I'm just gonna make a little bow to add to this cute little truck. And then I have this Dollar Tree ribbon that I got a while back and it's a little heart. So I'm just going to outline some just to decorate it a little more to make it more festive. And there you have your cute little Valentine's truck. This is probably another five minute craft, of course, because it just doesn't take a whole lot of time. The spray painting probably is the most because I spray painted it at night in my garage and then I let it dry overnight.
and I got this like love sign from the Dollar Tree. I went ahead and spray painted it with a pink can of spray paint that I had on hand that I probably have had for years. And again, I did it at night so that it would be dry in the morning. And then I'm using those same little rose, they're like little rosettes that you get from Dollar Tree. There they are, they're foam roses, 18 to a pack. And I'm just going to add it over the little O so you can still see that it looks like an O. So again, simple, quick, easy. You can make your Valentine crafts for your house or to give away. And it only takes like a few minutes. Right, these are the batteries that I got from Amazon and they work by remote. You can just press on your little remote control, they come on. I got these cute little, they're like candy, like you could put candy in them or I'm putting lights in this particular one. It's like the gumball machines, but they're hearts. And then I'm putting like the tag underneath so you can't really see it. So you can either put these in your three-tiered trays, you can just put them on a table. I have this cute little pink truck that I made at Christmas time that I'm gonna use year-round for different seasons. And I'm gonna put it in the back of this truck. I love this little pink truck that I made. And you can do different things with it. I also have a little red one that you can put candy in, which I did put candy in this one. I put some M&Ms that were white and red. And I just put them in this little truck and it sits in my dining room. I just think it's really cute how you can stick lights in it or candy. And there it is at nighttime because you can light it up. I have some extra lights that are inside the truck, so it's got two sets of lights on it. So if you would hit the subscribe button, I would appreciate it and the like and the notification bell so you'll know when the next video is coming out. It's been a rough week for us here in Virginia. We had power outages and some lasted three days, some lasted five, some lasted six, but we all survived and we're grateful that we have power back. So thank you for watching and I hope to see you in my next video and I hope you will be kind to yourself and be kind to each other. And I want to thank you for watching my video. Take care.